Hi everyone, in this problem we have a set, and the question is, which of the following are true statements? So let's go through each one and determine whether or not uh, the statements are in fact true. So the first statement here is telling us that the empty set is a subset of A. And that's always true because the empty set is a subset of every set. So this is true always true for any set even it doesn't even matter that it's this one it's always true the second statement is saying that the empty set is an element of a well it certainly is it's right here it's one of the members of the set a it's one of the elements so this is also true pretty interesting problem this one is saying that the set containing the empty set is an element of a which is also true there it is so that is true. This is saying that um, this set is a subset of A. This means that every element in this set is an element of A. Well, the only element in this set is the empty set, and that is an element of A. Therefore, the set containing the empty set is a subset of A. So this is also true, pretty wicked. This is saying that this set is a subset of A. So that means that every element in this set is an element of A. Well, the only element in this set is the set containing the empty set, and that is an element of A. So the set containing the set containing the empty set is a subset of A. So this is also true, ridiculous. This is saying that this is a subset of A. This means that these elements must also be in A, and they are. They are both in A. Therefore, the set containing these elements is a subset of A. And the last one is saying that this set here is an element of A, and it is. It's right here, right? That's an element of A. So all of these are actually true. So every single statement is true. Kind of, a, of an interesting problem. I picked this from from some random book. Um, I hope this video has been helpful in some way. That's it.